low light detection cannot be used while recording video. All right, it's Monday. I believe it's November. And it happens to be the 23rd. These are uh oh, these are that's a good list. You just pause on that. All right. Uh, I am just up in Adam. I was driving all night, and I am going to excitedly show you uh, what I do on my favorite mornings, and that is ship a game. Someone bought a game. I should look at this side. Someone got a game, so I'm going to ship one this morning, and I'm going to show you. Let's see if I can show you without showing any personal information here, but look at that. You see that at the bottom of that page? I'm going to have to look at that and make sure I didn't show off any information, but I think you can see that $15.80. I don't know. It's how much it costs to ship one of these suckers, all right? So shipping is expensive, but if you buy two games, so I understand that's a big purchase, but, you know, there's going to be somebody else who wants one of these that you know if you want one because you play games against people, <laughs> and playing games against people is... I think what we should be doing. Play games. That's the kind of competition we need. We need we need people to stop doing other stuff. So let's let's be at peace but compete in 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 fun ways. And I am super excited about this game. It's going somewhere in Kentucky. I don't know what's going on. Kentucky. So yeah. Uh I'm going to press print here. So this is Let's do this. Okay. Paper tray. Please. One shirt. Oh, labels. No, that's not correct. Ooh. Extra services. Huh, this is interesting. I don't have labels for uh for this. So that's Shipping label, eight and a half, yes, okay. Box, okay, print postage, once you print, that's okay. Paper tray. Interesting. All right, let's see what's going on here. It seems to be working fine. So these are thank you notes, a lot of these. These are saying thanks. Thanks for letting me stay at your place. Oh. Let's see if it's working. There it is. Okay, I'm kind of. Oh, gosh darn it. I don't like that that's the case. But, that's, uh. That's it. So I print that at home. I keep looking at the wrong... I gotta look at the hole. <laughs> that is what I think everyone says. <laughs> and that's uh, that's the postage with the address co uh, covered up. And now I keep looking at the wrong hole. Alright, so maybe I'll flip the... I think it'll work upside down. Maybe I'll flip the camera. I obviously want to look right. Okay. Uh... I love selling games. I don't know if you can tell this, but I love it when a game sells. Here, let's just go out here and get this done. Getting this done. Oh, I'm not cleaned up or anything, but here's the knockdown barns supplies that are going off right now. There's a bunch of uh, blocks I just continue to make. Um, I can't make them fast enough, to be honest. But, you know, I'll go, I'll be be going full time Here in a second um, okay so that you only really need half of it two games I was saying it I was saying you can get two games before I went on my let's be at peace rant and I fit them in the same flat rate box for $15.80 so two games, one box, $15.80 shipping, 
it's not so bad. All right, so that's that's on there. And <laughs> I'm pretty prepared. I mean, I got games. They're ready to go at this point of the holiday season. So when you get one, I ship it out real fast. But I don't think I'm going to have enough games uh, for everybody that wants one this year. I don't think I am. But if I do, that's great, and I'll be able to sell everybody games. But you can see this is a big stack of boards. This is all games right here. There's a big stack, and I got uh, a couple more big stacks of those, but not that many. I keep looking right. Anyway, this game's all packaged up. I'm going to set it down right in the box. Get it on ship, because I have to bug you out. I've got... Uh, Stuff to pick up, chairs to pick up. I do a little bubble wrap down in the bottom of the box. You know, I want to make sure that it's got some cush in the corners. Slides right in there. I know you couldn't see that, but it went in here. That's where that just went. It's inside one of those boxes. All right. Now something I do, I do this with every game, I take one of these uh, that I ship. This is a, uh, a free uh, street paper, street newspaper called The Red Eye. Uh, they put these out in Chicago. They're in these uh, bulbous red boxes on every other street corner. There's a ton of them. And they tell you what to do and where to go. And I want them to play Knockdown Barns this holiday season. Because I, I use their periodical. I use, I use their paper. I use their print. Look, there's Beebs. I'm showing you a Beebs one. Uh, uh, I use this to package up games. This, I now you know, take this and I crumple up the red eye. And I fit in the, the crumpled up red eye so that the game's not going to shake around in the box. This is some of my packaging material. And I just do this. This is just what I do. And I think the red eye and I should have a little talk about that. If anybody sees this, tweet to them. Let them know. Maybe I can start asking Matt. No one's watching these. But if someone does watch this, tweet to the red eye and say, hey, this guy... He uses your red he uses your red eye to package up a board game in your backyard red eye and in your backyard and I need some press I ain't gonna lie you know what I'm talking about come on I ain't too proud to beg I wish I knew some more lyrics <laughs> but that's none of your business all right, that's enough of the red eye. I mean, that's in there. That's not going anywhere. And uh, whenever I have the opportunity, you know, I use some of the packaging material that comes with the stuff I order. This happen these happen to come with the uh, burlap sacks. The burlap sacks. And that's it. It's in there. Ding. I love selling games. Games, games, games. Well game. Will I come up with another game? Yes. Maybe, uh, maybe, maybe, maybe you'll see, maybe you'll, maybe you'll see it first here. How about that? These things. You know, the expense of getting one of these boxes, you know, shipped to you, me, everyone. I don't pay this for this box. This box is sent directly to me. I get a bunch of, I can get, you know, as many as I ask for, I guess. And I got a whole bunch of them here. I can't pick them up. I got a whole bunch, you know. And so that's an expense I don't have, you know, having to buy a box. Packaging material, I basically am doing it for free with uh, the red eyes and also, you know, this packaging material. I can use whatever as long as it's keeping the box. You know, I don't want it shaking around. 
I want the game pretty solidly in there, you know. And I feel like if someone were to drop this, the game should survive. But I did recently get one that, I mean, the box looked awful. This, like, it looked like someone had dropped it from height. And it broke the board. And uh, there was a break in the board. And so I'm going to write, you know, please handle with care on these. Because you can't, you can't be dropping them. Can't be dropping these. Don't drop them. Thank you so much for shipping them post office. Please don't drop them. Um, and then, before it gets tagged, you know, I'll put the uh, I'll put the postage. You know, I'll glue, stick that right on the on the box. But I'm also going to write on every box. Because honestly, you can, if you open these boxes carefully enough, you can keep the game in the box. You can actually use this box for storage of Knockdown Barns, if you want. Because I know that sometimes a burlap sack doesn't fit as well on your shelf. Next time. Okay, I'm done with that. I gotta get out of here. But this will definitely be a great way of ending this day's vlog. Get your uh, set of knockdown bars. Thank you so much, uh, Kentucky, for uh, making my day uh, start off so nicely. Knockdown bars. You can always build again. Boop.